this is the energy vibration reading for the Aries Sun Moon and Rising so it is the week of duality it is the 11th week of the year 2018 and the week is going to begin from the 12th until the 18th I want to say to each and every person out there I want to say thank you for all the support the likes and the shares um, please subscribe and please like and share these videos okay it's a week of hair and water so there is going to be a lot of situation that is taking place so let's see what your week is going to be entailed on Monday you have um, the king of earth this is um, uh, the energy of an um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn that you had to do with on Monday on Tuesday you have the two of hair you're seeing things clearly about this person whether this person is on third Wednesday it is the ten of water so happiness with the family so you're connecting so this could be also a partner and then you have the energy of transformation so this is good so whatever is happening whatever is happening in your family life there is going to be a transformation in this week let's look at the weekend to see what's happening on Friday you have the three of Pentacles so you're working together to make something happen with the king of earth or the king of Pentacles and then you have the number seven energy something that was stolen uh, or you're going to find out about something and then you have the eight of pentacles so um and now we are going to look because um there's a lot of information that is going to come out you have the energy of the two of pentacles so um this could be you're balancing out your material world or there are situations that are happening around you which is going to be coming out very positive because it's duality so it's going to be good I want to say to you guys please remember that whenever it's the week of duality there's a lot of things are going to happen especially in this year when you're in the week with two um, energies that are here for you so you know be aware of what is transpiring okay um the first half of the week there is a situation with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and you're seeing the situation clear and you're working together to understand what exactly is going on so let's see what is the situation with this King or Queen of Pentacles that you're now seeing clearly that you're working together and this is going to be good because there is going to be a happy outcomes okay um, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming out for this person okay so the center of the first half of the week it's going to be the energy of um, you know um, the six of cups is here and the six of cups in the reverse form um, this is going to be a situation that you had to deal with with um, someone um, that is and was um, a sort of a um, family or a, a karmatic situation and now it is finally coming to an end okay then we're looking at the two of here the two of here is good because there's going to be a positive family situation and this could um, have to deal with um, someone who is an um, yourself or it could be someone who's a Leo or a Sagittarius so you could be having um, seeing a situation with a family situation and um, you're balancing out the situation um, because we see that the situation was in balance middle of the week and the center of your week um, you have the energy of the six of swords in the reverse form which means this situation has ended and this is good there was a situation that you have done something to someone who's a Taurus or a Capricorn or for some of you it is a family situation that uh, um, that uh, situation has transpired and now things are happening you have the, the, the a wonderful happy family life and um, you're going to find inner strength to deal with the transition that is coming in because a huge transition is coming in and then you have this situation with the eight of um, hurt the eight of hurt is that you're trying to work on the transition that is coming in or with the family 
and the outcomes is going to be um, yourself the tool of a new start and a new beginning that is going to be happening for you and that family okay it could be that a situation there has been so much um, injustice and so much weird situation that has been happening with you and your family and now there is finally an healing there is a situation that has um, transpired with um, this person is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra and you're finally seeing um, the situation for whatever it is um, because um, it's as if um, whatever the situation that transpired is that this person was not being um, very honest about certain things and you found out about this okay and the last energy that you have that is connecting in the weekend because in the weekend you're going to find out that um, that um, um, this Queen of Swords have stolen something and uh, you are going to see the truth of a situation um, it is someone who has uh, stolen um, something and now you are seeing it could be stolen your work or it could be um, that she has stolen something for you and then um, what is going to happen is that um, with um, the energy comes in because it's 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 like a week of you balancing out um, whatever situation is there and that sort of a thing and it's as if um, this balancing out of situation um, in the beginning um, whatever the situation is for some of you men and women you are going to um, put the family back together it's as if you're going to try to put the family back together the seven of swords is here twice so duality I've been saying this to a lot of people this week is a week of duality and I can see it coming in the readings because just about every sign reading that I've done before there is the energy of duality you have um, the energy of the seven of swords whatever that is stolen whatever that was stolen from you is going to be returned to you okay because there was a theft that has uh, taken place and whatever that has stolen from you is going to be um, returned to you okay the number two energies are here so you have the two of wands um, so let's look at the beginning in the beginning of the week some of you have a situation with um, the king of Pentacles this king of Pentacles is going to work together with you um, to um, sh uh, let you see a situation clearly okay um, the energy of the six of cups is the energy of um, whatever the situation is with a, a family situation um, because there was an, an, an injustice that um, um, that was taken that, that had happened um, you're going to um, have success as we move forward we're looking at the situation um, you ladies are going to have a good balance with your family life and that sort of a situation some of you are going to find out that whoever this king or queen of um, Aquarius Gemini or Libra they have done something they had stolen something but this is going to be returned to you as we look forward we have the energy of strength so um, you're going to find strength um, in a situation with a family member and there is going to be an opening it's as if an healing is going to take place and um, some of you are going to be working on this situation so um, for a lot of you the you are going to find out that something was being stolen from you and whatever that has been stolen from you whether money whether love whether opportunity whether whatever that is and that has been stolen from you you are going to see this happening that um, you're going to receive the message and then you're going to try to bring a healing um, in this situation and you are finally going to find um, peace peace with the situation uh, forgiveness needs to take place because if there is no forgiveness um, you are going to be um, realizing that you have to find forgiveness for these people and these situation the number two dualities you guys are really working with the number two the number two comes up three times so what it is saying is that um, hold positive thoughts because things are going to be good okay number two came up 
um, so many times in your reading it's going to be good whatever the situation is with your family life this is also going to be good so let's see what is going to be the other energies for you guys um, time for a nap time for a nap but whenever it says time for a nap that means that you need to take some rest and you need to take time out you need to slow down because some of you can work yourself to the bones and it's a saying in this week it is time for a nap so this is going to be um, wonderful whatever is happening um, money is going to come to some of you um, whatever that was taken away from you whatever that was stolen from you um, a sense of pride a sense of money is going to be coming into you and there is going to be positive energies I want to say to each and every person um, thank you please remember to listen to your Sun Moon and Rising side namaste